All right, this video is how to use the swipe feature in your email. So anyway, so you opened up this email. I get this Comcast email, and I get a, I, every month I get something from them for, for my Xfinity account. So if I put my cursor right here, and then I slide my index finger across my mouse, not up and down my mouse, but across my mouse, this is going to get rid of uh, this uh, um, email. What's, what it's going to do is you're going to see a little red delete there. If I keep going, it just disappears. Now let's say um, I read this email, but I don't want it. I want to mark it unread. What I can do is I can put my cursor over here on the right side, and I can slide across my mouse laterally, not up and down, and look what it does. It pulls it here, and bam, see that little blue dot came back. I mean, the, now it looks like I never read the email. So here, let's, let's click on this one, and there's another way you can get rid of it. All you got to do is click on it, highlight it, blue, with your cursor, and then just hit the delete button on your, um, on your keyboard. Bam, it's gone. So that's a couple different ways that you can do that. Now let's say I want to make this look like I didn't read it. I just go like that. Bam, it's, it's unread. And so let's say I go onto my keyboard and I press uh, the down arrow, and it just moves the uh, it moves it up and down, up and down. And if you notice, when you do that, it 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 shows them being red. So if you want to go up and down. You can go down by pressing the down arrow, and it just goes down through all of your different emails. If you want to go back up, you just go up this way by pressing the up arrow. But you got to remember, when you do that, let me just uh, unread one real quick. Okay, that's unread. All right, now when I watch what happens, I'm going to go down and watch. Bam, now it shows it as being read. So if you want to mark it unread, what you got to do is pull it that way and then you get your little blue dot back alright if you do it on this one look it does it too so that's how it works alright if you like this video please subscribe to my channel I've got a bunch of them on how to use uh, you know your Mac stuff and Final Cut Pro which is the thing that's the, the program that's right behind this and um, YouTube and all that stuff alright uh, if I can figure it out so can you peace out